air. Okay, Kyle, you want to start this in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hello guys, welcome back to, well, no, this is the first time, um, welcome to Kyle Edwards Minecraft Let's Play. But, there is a special thing going on, which is going to, so we're going to put in a seed, so we're going to call this one Potato. Okay, so that way you can find it out, we're going to have this on. I'm not going to be able to change this, and there's a reason why. General structures, done. Oh yeah. Look at this. See? You can't change them because we're playing hardcore. Yeah, that's right. We don't do hardcore let's play. This let this series and ends when I die. So yeah, and then it starts off the next season. So let's do this. Mine. There's no, capital. Minecraft. Hard. Core. Let's play. Yeah. Create new world. So now we have to wait. This isn't lagging, it's just me waiting for this to load. Oh, here we go. Oh. So, as you can see, I'm running the Sfax texture pack. We're getting a bit of lag as the world generates. Uh, just wait for that to deal with it. Um, Okay, check over my settings to make sure they're optimal to um, recording. Video settings, uh, bright, we don't want vCynic, no, we don't want that. They can stay like that for now unless we get a real problem. How's that looking? I am going to quickly um, do something and I'll be right um, and welcome back. Sorry about that. I just quickly sorted something out. There might be another cut because, as you can see, my computer. I'm getting a couple of upgrades for it um, soon, and um, well, something is really munching up my FPS. I only fun out. So hardcore, one life. That's it. There's no respawning. This game is set onto the maximum difficulty there is. And the mobs are gonna come and get me. If I get hit by a creeper, I'm dead. That is something which is a real problem. So we definitely don't want to get hit by a creeper. We want to get food because if I use all my food nuggets, um, sound way too little high. Let's get that to a nice 50. Because good old 50. Right. So I want to get some food quickly very quickly I can there's some sheep I want to get a bed soon because so I because sleeping through the night would really help my cause there's no mobs I don't really want mobs oh we've got a couple of pigs that's good pigs are good pigs are really good for the cause um getting a bit more generation lag um nothing much I can do about it it's just the world's loading up you can see I'm using the Sfax 128 bit texture pack. Um, personal favourite, I can't really go with anything else. I sometimes go with just default if I'm really bored or I'm playing the mod pack. Um, so, yeah, we've got to do this hardcore. So, gonna, so first few days is just me getting around and getting some surprising sound. I can just hear it. It might just be me. But it might just be me, but. Um, Oh, there we go. Might just be me, but I can really hear that on my ears. It's really annoying. So you want to get rid of all this grass to get some seeds quickly. Um, and persist on quick, because if we have a look. I've turned clouds off. I just The spike clouds are a bit bug. Look, I'll quickly show you. Um, where is it? Clouds on. Um, they're a bit bugged. Look at them. They're like that. They're... There's an enderman. There's an enderman right over there. Well, oh, God, he nearly jumped into my side. Options. Uh, that's off. Right. So that's what I've clouds off. No real. So, seems that Enderman are already making, becoming a problem. 
So the main objective on this is of course is to get to the end and defeat the Ender Dragon. I can already tell you I'm probably not going to be able to do that in my first world because I'm... Jeez, that Enderman is really getting close and dangerous. I'm going to get close to some water. I do not like the idea of dying. I wonder if they're naturally hostile in um, Hardcore. So, we need to get a lot of seeds if you really need to get growing stuff quickly. There's a desert over there, nothing much can really be achieved from the desert unless I can find an NPC village. Because NPCs means they'll have a farm and I'll be able to get a. Ooh, not going to be going in there. Um, I do not really want to be waiting around for this food to grow, so where I do decide to grow this will be where I start my base up because. There's really much moving around. We want to get enchantments quickly. Um, mostly because enchantments means I can protect myself. We also want to get armor. Armor is a main priority. I need to negate enough damage from it so I can have a long enough time to stop it. Is it not the same endum following me? I'm really getting worried. So I'm just also, whilst collecting these seeds, I'm also doing a quick scout around, um, seeing what's in the local area. To know that. So hopefully, if I get, I'll get enough seeds to become a sustainable source. Um, the first thing I want to do is I want to quickly find some. Now that I've got, I've got about 40 something seeds, so I'll quickly keep walking. I don't really like grass anyway, so if I because this probably there's no real chance of me moving because you've got to keep in the same spot um, for as long as possible. Um, we're looking at 15 minute episodes for this series. Um, there, some surface stone. Make our way over there. Um, I'm not going to run, that would just waste way too much hunger. I've played enough de daisy to know when to sprint and jump. Because jumping, oh, see, I've already lost half the hunger bar. Now, in the normal world, that really wouldn't matter. Oh, we got lava. Ah, problem. If I fall in that, game over. Game over, man. Game over. So, gonna carefully pursue. Now, I've got to, I'm not going to, like, just hide in my house all the time. I'm, Hopefully, going to get a bit more adventurous. But I'm not going to go. I might go stupid, but I'm not going to go too stupid. Because it's a problem with me. I usually do. Um, right. There was an egg. Good. Got some chickens. Oh yes, yes. Yeah. Right. So it looks like we don't need to go there because we've just got ourselves an NPC village. We want to get over there. Get that food. There's a pumpkin. This is brilliant. It's really good. I'm not going to rob one of their houses, but. Because I know that zombies will flood to this place, which is really good, because... Oh god, I'm going to hear the bloody Java sounds, aren't I? Oh no, these have got normal sounds. I can't like, remove that. So, we're going to grab all of this. And as much of this as possible, because this is really going to help. Let's get all these carrots. But we need to get away from this village. Because zombies love to spawn around it to get to the zombie villagers. Sure enough, I know it's gonna go, and I'm not really good at trading, so. Our oh, potatoes, got some potatoes, some carrots, we've got a village, there should be. I wonder if we can find a crafting table or a smith. Um, you look like, what you got? Nine gold for thing. Look at this. Ah. <laughs> you just have fun, I can just have fun with that sound, we've got no time for that! We've gotta go! We've gotta keep moving. Just trying to get out of there as much food as possible. If it... Right, so the sun is starting to set. Um, so we need to get really close to finishing this off now because we just gotta get into somewhere safe. We've only got five pieces of wood. So my first place where I'm gonna be hunkered down is probably gonna be a little hole in the ground or something. Nothing too fancy. I would pick up, like, I would start picking up their houses, but. Um, there's just no point. I mean, I gotta get somewhere safe and close. Quickly. So, continue getting the carrots and the potatoes because they're the best. Because I can just eat them straight away, don't need to craft anything. I know I could cook the potatoes, but um, there's really no point. I'll just quickly eat some carrots. There we go. They're not really good with um, keeping you saturated, but they keep me alive for now. So we'll walk away from the village, walk back to our spawn, even though 
I'm never going to be seeing that. I'm never going to be respawning in this world because hardcore. We've got to do this. Um, there's a poppy here. I get that. Uh, we probably want to get a couple of dogs to protect me. Right, this forest here. Uh, we're gonna get a couple of dogs to protect me so I can be a bit more safe. Okay. Right. Let's okay. Okay, let's gather these pumpkins. Because if I do go into the end, I I've actually been to the end before and um, on a survival world. Um, and I was I had pumpkins with me and where's the sun? There's the sun. And the pumpkins were quite useful because on Spax you don't see you don't get what you do in normal Minecraft where um you know the pumpkin vision the pumpkin vision is just too difficult to see so there's no point but in this in Spax you can actually see all the way through. Um, I know I should shear the sheep but I've got no shears and I need to get the wall I want to sleep. Right here this open spot here where I think I spawned here this is a good spot. Uh, it's a bit of an open patch which I must have made. Um, so let's quickly make a crafting table, get a sword, oh god, we need to get into the house now, we need to make a house now, um, this bit of dirt, we'll dig into here, uh, crafting table, uh, da 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 I'm panicking, I gotta keep a calm. Gotta keep. I know I'm making wooden tools, but I need them for um quick access. Come on, break it. Right, I need to get a bit more wood. Not much. I won't take down the entire tree. I just need a bit. Okay, and this one. Right, give me that. All right, quick into this hole. Okay, let's open this up a bit. We gotta get ourselves secure. There is no point in making this place look fancy, I just need some space to work. I'm gonna block ourselves in, because if I make a door as long as we'll just break it down. Okay, you probably can't see because YouTube has a tendency to make things darker, so I'm gonna explain right now I'm just digging a couple of um, stones so I can get some coal stones so I can get a furnace. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, is that coal? No, it's not coal. Okay, um, make a furnace and we'll smelt down some. Da, 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 boop, boop. Right, let's put some of that in. Get some of that. Ah, there we go. Some light. Okay, do I have still have enough wood? Cool. Right, let's get a bed. Oh, do I have enough wool? Wait. No, I don't. No. I'm not going out there. I don't have enough wool. Damn it. Ah, brilliant. So, it looks like the first night's going to be spent hiding in this hole until night time ends and daytime is upon us. Which is brilliant because there's nothing for me to do. Just get some torches to get this place lit up. Right, we'll just quickly gather some cobblestone. Oh, we've almost at the end of this first episode, but I tell you what, things have gone well. We've got ourselves a base, got ourselves a big stockpile of food until I can get a nice farm going. I've already got quite a few ideas on a house. Um, they'll have to, they'll 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 be coming soon. Um, let's get mining. Um, when it when it comes to daytime, we'll go out, we'll adventure a bit more, get some more um, wool because we need wool. Get some more wood because we're running low on that. Um, and we should be good. Okay, I'm just getting a bit more cobblestone and making a little stairway down because I'm going to get strip mining. I know strip mining is kind of a boring thing, but it's going to be survival really. This is survival, and um, I need every single trick I know will be put to the test just to see how long, just so I can survive. Um, yeah, so we got ourselves a little thing. Uh, inventory, we're not doing really well on stuff, but it should keep us alive for now. I have been drowning for about 50 minutes now. Yeah, give or take a few. So, um, it's Cars 1 just on, on episode 1 of Minecraft Hardcore, and I'll see you guys next time.
Bye.